Football's back. The Premier League is returning. Football's back! Yes, football is entertainment, but entertainment should not come at a cost of anything, especially health-wise. Um, I'm happy, don't get me wrong, and I'm still going to watch football, but at the same time, I just feel like maybe it is a bit too soon. We could be crowned champions of England for the first time in 30 years. Obviously, I'm ecstatic that the football's coming back. Us Newcastle fans, we're in a bit of an odd space right now, as we're obviously in the uncertain stages of a potential takeover. So I guess there'll be a lot of us who'll just hope that the return of the Premier League could speed up the process a little. I will be watching every single game, probably with a beer, on the phone to my dad if I can. I can't wait to be sat there in my living room, in my pants probably, watching it. <laughs> Very different uh, from how I normally watch it. Playing behind closed doors would affect Arsenal for sure, 100%. We've got a 60,000 seat stadium, the atmosphere, the energy. Yeah, I think, they'll, I think they'll struggle to come to terms with that. Every single fan, player, manager, we're all in the same boat, so we've got to realise there's no advantages for anyone. We're all going to have to just get on with it. And uh, listen, it means we're going to have to scream louder from home. I think the home fans played a really important part in getting the players over the line. Now that we're going to be playing behind closed doors, that's probably going to wipe out our home advantage. I think it will be hardest for players at clubs that will be fighting in the relegation battle. Um, because everyone knows how important the fans are in the last few games where they've got so much to play for. Couldn't care less how the Liverpool fans are going to feel, to be honest with you. Let's not forget, currently we're champions of the world, Europe and soon to be England. When that trophy is lifted in front of five or 500,000 people, for me it doesn't matter. For them to wait so long for a league title, for them to finally get there and not be able to celebrate it, it really is sad. And that's me as an Arsenal fan saying it, so you better understand I'm saying it from the heart.